Hello everyone, welcome to Sis My Lifestyle Vlogs. Welcome back to the channel for those who are regular subscribers. If you're not, if you're seeing this for the first time, do not miss the opportunity. There are more funny lifestyle and fashion content on this channel, so do subscribe. Thanks in advance. Anyway, this video will be me sort of bragging about my mini designer shoe collection and also I have two boxes here to show you. I will be styling my outfits so you will see cutaways. I will be saying cutaways a lot in this video so make sure we count them all together and let me know how many you've counted. I will do my own counting. Anyway, cutaways is the word of this video. <laughs> Let's start with my box because I want to unbox this first and uh, show you preview of what you'll be seeing. So, this box, this is a present from Dominic. He recently got it for me for International Women's Day. And I'm super excited to style it and potentially wear it out for dinner because we're going out tonight. As you can see, perhaps by the light, that it's getting to evening. Anyway, these are the most epic shoes and I'm very, very excited to try them on. There are lots of details. You can clearly see that Dominic was choosing this. Um, I don't think I would have choose it for myself, but I like the front of the heel very much of the shoe. This is the stiletto by Philip Lang, so we'll try that. I will call this my Halloween shoes. So yeah, definitely I have a Halloween look to come for this so this is something to try we're gonna try later in this video and i have another box to show you right now because it's clearly i mean it's been in the box for over a year now we bought it last year at about the same time in san ramo and it was almost like love at first sight it was versace they were glorious and I've not opened it for an entire year because uh, circumstances, things, and we didn't have occasion to go to wear these heels. Anyway, are you ready? Because I'm not seeing them for a while, so... Ooh, oh my goodness! Look at them. Wow, just from the box you can see this is gorgeous. Absolutely. What is this shoe? Wow, 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 wow. Seriously, you guys. I forgot how beautiful they are. All the detail and the satin. They are Versace heels, sandals, sort of gladiator sandals. Really, really cool. So, basically, my idea is that I'll style a few outfits with these shoes. I also have some shoes at the back that I'll show you in a moment, but let's start with the look of today. So you will see the shoes that I'm wearing right now, a beautiful pair of Jimmy shoes. And I will keep the number so you will let me know your favorite pair and uh, sort of share the passion for well-made designer shoes because all of this is impeccable and if you're interested in this kind of content. Seriously, do you know how many times I tried to start this video? It's not even funny. The weather is not been on my side, then I didn't like my hair, then I didn't like how I sound, I didn't like the light of the camera, but do you know what? Let's do this anyway, so welcome. <laughs>
let's go with the first look I really like this dress and how it makes me feel like Monica Bellucci you are absolutely right if you're thinking that the gloves should be higher but I thought do you know what let's do this anyway I can't overthink it and just going with the flow for a pop of color we are here for the shoes I also tanned believe it or not I tried to tan and make my legs look slightly less after winter vibe because honestly it's still a bit cold here in Switzerland so there you go the vibe yes I have two mirrors here and the light situation um, sometimes it helps sometimes it doesn't so that's our first proper look and the shoes they are Jimmy shoes I'm so in love with them we got them in Paris last time I went with Dominique to Versailles by the way check out the vlog if you haven't seen I haven't worn them ever since that night because because we really didn't go out anywhere but looking at them again they are comfortable I must say I can almost do a little dance and I absolutely love it and it's a really cool dinner look I think so by the way I might be rumbling quite a bit in this video so do not let me I will need to show you a few more pairs I have the Gucci's to try on and yeah those and you will see later in the video my oldies but goldies collection Givenchy's and other Jimny's and Cassidy's so there's still kind of lots of things to see in this video and my apologies in advance for the light anyway that's the first look absolutely love those jimmies absolutely they're so comfortable the difficult part would be to try the Versace so I think I think I will quickly try the Gucci's with this look because you've seen them before and yeah I will be trying on my best to fit the accessories where possible because I know you guys love gloves so much me too I grew to love wearing gloves much more often so thanks a lot for your inspiration uh, let's try the Gucci's oh, I just can't believe I have to I'm gonna go show Dominic how gorgeous these are Oof, the stick It's so funny, I said a lot of times that you will see in the cutaways and yet in the previous clip I completely forgot to film a little video of that outfit. Anyway, I hope you forgive me for this one, we'll try better. I'm trying on my Gucci shoes, I absolutely love them and even though from this side it doesn't look like it matches but if you turn around the soles of the shoes are pink which perfectly reasons why I decided to wear them. At the same time, I think other shoes from my collection could go really well. As I said, you still have a few to look forward to. I'm just trying on the Gucci's at the moment. I like them, but to be honest with you, those are really specific shoes. So I took them to Versailles, but I just worn them very briefly for a quick look and that was it and uh, yeah I like it I like this dress very much let me try another pair of shoes with this dress because I think we could potentially rectify the situation I've changed the shoes for this dress by the way before I forget this and the previous dress um, by Dolce & Gabbana kindly passed over to my from my sister to me I love this look this is perfect this is actually wearable in my sort of outfit challenge vocabulary I could have worn this for dinner tonight by the way we still need to come up with a look and uh, what I'm gonna wear 
Yeah, I love this very, very much. Anyway, let's keep on trying on the shoes. I have two more pairs to try with you still. We can see that Jimmy Choo's, this model, is absolutely a love. I was saying that even though these are a pair of... They're, they're like souvenirs, they're like ornaments almost. The Gucci's, love them very much. In the size 39... Why do we... Yeah. 39 and a half, as you can see here, Gucci made in Italy, beautiful sole, really hotel shoes I call them because they're really for lobby bar outfits only, but these potentially can see the life out and we see that also it goes very well with the dresses of different colors, that's why I picked the golden version of these because there's also tenth and brown and golden and blue and silver and anything but we've seen this in Jim Choo's store in Paris and got them so next look let's do this Oh my goodness, these shoes are a vibe on its own, as I say for some reason, no particular reason. I'm wearing a beautiful Christian Dior skirt, also passed over from my sister, much appreciate. And I'm wearing a t-shirt from Love Stories, and it says Love Stories Hotel Paris or Place de la Moue Paris, so I really like this t-shirt. Shall we try some gloves with this look? I think we absolutely must. I'm gonna give a go to my lovely Thomasine gloves. Again, give it another go to my Thomasine gloves. I still keep the tag on, but sometimes I think that I should give them more credit because they are beautiful. After all, let's do the left one first. No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. I think it's fun. I can see it is a fun look already. Yes, I still have a tag because I'm still contemplating of changing these gloves to potentially a different color. And, oh my goodness, this beautiful skirt christian dior if i don't talk about it enough her she is a beauty look at all this draping incredible detail i love it so much and the fact that it's got a pocket and we've got the gloves on looking fantastic so this is my look little parisian cutesy wootsy and we have the sunset look at that gorgeous sunset i don't know if you can see on the camera but luckily you know i'm i'm really apologizing in advance because there were days in this you can see the camera from every angle i tried to film this video for the past few days and my excuse is the poor light i've been ready i did my hair i did pedicure i even fake tanned which didn't work on me as you can see but yeah also there's an opportunity to see what was actually written on the shirt on the t-shirt really good quality t-shirt and i like my look let me know in the comments below with regards to the shoes they are very very nice and uh, comfortable but i do not think i will wear them uh tonight this is dominic's choice we do this between each other when i buy shoes for me and he buys shoes so that he's like and sort of involved in the process and expresses his style as well something that encourages me to wear different things as well so <laughs> so this is the pair 
of Philip lines and the heel is extremely extremely high in them and I do like them here and there I mostly like the front of the stiletto part I think it's very sleek and sexy of course and I paired them down with this look I think it works very nicely again do let me know okay we have one pair left to try in this sort of new unboxing what's new and i have as well some style options for those shoes so please keep on watching till the end of the video and also to see what i will actually wear tonight for our date night at the fairmont hotel montra how exciting let me move on <laughs> Guys, finally have the opportunity to try on this dress. You'll see the whole look all together. But these are the shoes that Dominic forgot about completely. And I'm so excited that he's home now. I'm gonna have a look all together. It's a little bit of off to get into the shoes at first, but once they're on, they're just brilliant. Look at the colors and everything. Let's try. We almost have the bells for the last look. This is a beautiful blue marine dress. Gorgeous, wearing it for the first time. And these shoes that have been in a dust bag, in a box for over a year now, simply because there's no occasion to wear them. And this has to change, I think. Shall I pair it with a pair of gloves? But I think, to be honest, a pair of gloves here is slightly too much. There's already enough in this look as it is. It's gorgeous, gorgeous dress, mustardy, mustardy color, golden detail, blue marine dress, very body fitting. But I think the heels, they do go, not necessarily, perhaps. We're going with the flow. So absolutely epic obsessed with these shoes can't wait to wear them somewhere exceptionally glam mon dieu can you tell i did try to fake tan but nothing happened so you would be probably wondering is it possible to walk in them of course very very carefully if you've seen my previous summer shoes collection you would know that i have some heels that are much higher than this although lately i've not been going out to places where this could be appropriate this is kind of like a red carpet med gala um incredible birthday party and uh, donatellas for example because these versaces are fantastic fantastic uh yeah you can see that uh, the heel is absolutely huge and you do have to be careful but uh, to be honest comfortable so this is sort of that pair of shoes that you wear only to the restaurant to the event and uh, if you're brave enough maybe go dancing but be careful <laughs> love this and now I have to quickly get ready for dinner tonight I don't know what I'm gonna wear but stay tuned till the end of the video to find out because basically we've seen few pairs 
but there are some more to see and my favorite Givenchy's you'll see them next Oh my goodness, my dears, do you know what I realized? That my camera was in the wrong setting. I can see clearly now the whole outfit. I'm so happy. So there you go. The look that we're gonna be sort of wearing for the first time. It's a spring look, as I said. It is, or did I not? It is a Dior, Christian Dior skirt and this lovely tailor-made beautiful blouse so this is kind of the first look look at <laughs> outside is slightly slightly grim but we're going on with the style so as you can see style in my Givenchy's they are so gorgeous I'm so happy with them and I think these particular pair actually even though it is almost like a boot but it elongates the leg so in my previous trial i tried actually to put the jimmy's jimmy shoes to try on with the blue ones i thought it could go very nicely together but not actually this is much better As I said, I did prepare a rail to try on and hopefully we can proceed with the styling with daylight, in fact. But I'm trying on the beautiful, oh my goodness, look at this combination. That is just perfect. So these are the Jimmy Choo's. I had them for a while, absolutely love them, cannot even think to get rid of them or anything like that. They are in amazing condition, even though I worn them for a few years out and about. And I'm wearing the new dress, sort of kimono style. This is from Riviera Concept Boutique. And oh my goodness, this is Naomi's own brand. I love it so much. I love the vibe. I'm not sure what to style it with in terms of like a bag and jewelry and so on. I can always put lots of things on, however, a simple necklace right here, a little golden shine, and yeah, I think it is totally a party dress, party outfit, lounge bar, with your girlfriends or a date night. This color is not usual, however, as we're talking about designer shoes, these Jimmy Choo's, they were the first ones in my collection and I love them so much, seriously. They are comfortable and I think why what makes them really like a spring, spring vibe is their color. The color doesn't always pick up on the camera, however, if you move ever so slightly and you can see that beautiful velvet blue, royal blue against this mustardy, rich velvet of the kimono and we've got a 
Dracula combination. Absolutely love this look. Let's see in the cutaways what we make of it. <laughs> I just realized that this dress potentially could be an amazing combination to wear with my gloves, which I have also prepared here. Let's see in the box from Thomasine. But the ones that supposedly be my new driving gloves, there they are. Let's try this whole combo. Oh my goodness. This somehow is turning out to be <laughs> leather gloves combo as well. Let's see. Oh. Spectacular. Oh, is it only me? But does this work? These gloves are incredibly made. Also, love them a lot. And because of this golden detail, a golden mesh sort of detail and tan leather, well, tan, I think it was more like olive green when I first saw it. And I love it very much. Let's see. You can see here in the cutaways, but I think this works. Do let me know in the comments below, by the way, which look was your favorite. There was a time when a company approached me to see if I would be interested to recommend some tops to you guys. So to be honest, it's been four years and it is the first time that I'm actually wearing this top. Needless to say, we didn't work with the company. However, I thought just to try out this sort of like biker look you will see in the cutaways that I'm wearing leggings and I want to make these cassettes work. No close-ups, just at the back of the heel so you can see how much I love wearing these shoes. The actual look that I was going for with this jacket. I feel like so influencer vibes right now because I have two light systems going on. But it's true, the daylight is the best light to film with. And honestly, as it goes away, and plus it's been cloudy and rainy the whole day, so I just have to do with what I have. Yeah, that's cute. That's more me. You will see in the cutaway here. I really appreciate this kind of this kind of outwear. And obviously the sandals, they are oldies but goldies. Mon Dieu. How many years now? So Dominic got me as a pair for my birthday. Um, I think it was 2020 and I had to go and exchange that and you saw these from Attitude Boutique. The boutique unfortunately has moved to another location that we don't know yet if it's any, anything anywhere available. I would link it below otherwise this video is not a promotion video. It's mostly to show off my collection and it's a growing collection. I absolutely love all of my pairs and obviously these guys. You see how comfortable they are that I could just grab them. So yes, the heel is high, but make sure you get your size. My size varies between 39 and a half and 40. And this, if you have a look here, it says 10. So honestly, I really don't know what we're talking about in terms of sizing. This is the proof of my size 10. It's not like it's a 40 rubbed off. No, <laughs> on both of them. It says made in Italy, Vericoil, which is real leather, size 10. So absolutely love those babes. They come out every summer, absolutely.
this is another pair of Jimmy Choo's that I'm trying on. I have three pairs so far. Proud bragger right here. This was also a present from Dominic. So, very excitedly. Let me know in the comments which outfit was best. This with Jimmy Choo's or the one with Casa Days because essentially it's the same shirt the same type of hairstyle, the same legging or call them bicycle shirt. How do you call them? Bicycle shorts? Something like this. I quite like it. Let me try another glove before we get too upset. Hold on. I think it's a very cool look with the gloves. You've seen these gloves before. They're slightly battered because I did drive in them just to point out what happens to my driving gloves they get battered completely but the look essentially we're in the same style love the shirt absolutely cute little number got it in naples so the shoes the important part about the shoes is that I still love them. They are quite comfortable. And that's why actually I recommend to wear tights with some shoes. This is my, let's say, April, April to May shoe. Sometimes I do wear it in summer. I find it very cool, the vibe that they give, especially with denim. I think you can't really go wrong. Someone told me that, um, snake skin is out of trends this year but to be honest when you have your own style you really follow your own vibe and good quality shoes that you bought with love they will last you for as long as you want really for as long as you want to style them and wear them they will last you that's it my dears the last look for this lovely video I actually had a good time filming and laughing and being overly complicated because of the light and the weather but I think everything came out nicely that's the look for dinner as I said we're going to Montrebella's Fairmont Nikki Nine Sushi so that's sort of my grungy, elegant look you will see in the cutaways. Honestly, I'm going to have to be editing this vlog and thinking how many times can one say cutaways. But anyway, let's see if we counted correctly together. So that's the last look. I love it. And I'm wearing Casa Days because I'm channeling, I'm channeling. British girls, the northerners, to bring me into the spring vibes and start to wear things that are actually season appropriate now because I tend to be a bit cold but this is a very chic chic look I don't know if I'm gonna grab a coat or just a scarf to go with this but that's it, love it let me know what you think in the comments and thanks for tuning in please subscribe we are this close to 1000 subscribers i cannot believe this voila there we are love the look in a good mood let's go for dinner me and dominic and you guys have a good evening wherever you are good day um all the best and thanks to all of your support and see you in my next video take care and bye bye